Hey, what's up guys? In this video, I'm going to go ahead and show you all the locations for small animals that fit inside your satchel, as well as their pelts. This is going to be hopefully something to get us ready for this trader update that is coming out today. Um, I'm thinking it's going to be more of a trapper roll based on the trailer. So, I do a lot of daily challenge videos, but when I use those locations for those specific animals and plants on the day, I try to list everything as conveniently as possible so you can get the most amount of challenges done at once. But this is going to be a little bit more in-depth. I'm going to go ahead and pinpoint the locations where you can find them. I want to give a shout out to KZ Diver who asked me a couple weeks ago about doing this video. I am also going to be doing two other videos. One about all the bird locations so you can use your feathers and stuff for the trader roll. And then also large pelts and medium pelts that would store on top of your horse. So I also will be time stamping each individual animal so you don't have to watch a whole entire video if you're looking for one specific thing. I'll put that in the description box and also in a pinned comment on this video. First up, Armadillo, you can find them basically in the New Austin area in between these four points. All in this general area you should be able to find them. So next up we're going to talk about Badgers. Some of my favorite spots would be that specific location right there. Over here in the Heartlands as well. Down south in Lemoyne I tend to find a good amount of them. And also up in the Valentine area not too far from that location right there. You can also find them in places like Big Valley, you can find them in tall trees. So there are pretty good amount of locations that you can go ahead and find these. Up next we have bats, which I'm not sure how big of a role they're gonna play in this trader update, but I figured I'd go ahead and include all the animals that fit inside your satchel. This is a great spot to go and get them on the southern coast of Rhodes. You can also find them over here, just on this peninsula over at Blue Water Marsh. There's the cave at Elysian Pool, and then also another cave at Roanoke Valley. For Chipmunk, you're going to find these in a lot of heavily wooded areas. Some of my favorite spots to find these would either be the southern part of Rhodes, you can also find them here in the southern part of Cumberland Forest, but another good location would be this area here, in between basically Wallace Station, Big Valley, all along Little Creek River, you can find tons of chipmunks. For frogs and toads, we're going to go ahead and group these in the same category. Obviously, you can find these a lot. We move on to Gila monsters. You can find these pretty commonly in the New Austin area. My specific favorite spot is just this spot over here at Trillo Springs, just a little north of the horse farm, usually on the dirt road, you usually can find a couple of them, and that would definitely be my recommendation if you're in a jam and trying to find some. Next up, we're going to go ahead and talk about Iguana, same thing, these are really located all over New Austin, specifically this island right here is probably my favorite spot, a lot of times when I go there you can find three, up to five of them at once, so that helps if you're trying to get perfect pelts. Now you can also find them on this island that is just a little west of Braithwaite Manor. So muskrat is another thing that's pretty commonly found around major waterways. I would say the Heartland Overflow, this area over here at Blue Water Marsh, and then another location that I usually always go to when I'm in a jam and trying to find them pretty fast would be this stream that leads just a little north near the Cougar Spawn location in Big Valley, and also at these spots near the water in New Austin. So a possum. These things are pretty tricky sometimes, but a lot of times you can hear their little tone, they make a screeching noise, and then you can hear them actually hit the ground, they kind of play dead. Another thing that's found pretty commonly around water, one of my favorite spots would be southern part of Rhodes. You can also find them over in this area, just a little north of Blue Water Marsh. For rabbits, I think everybody knows where you can find these. I could have put waypoints all over the map, but I tend to find a lot around this area here, kind of north of Blue Water Marsh. You can also find them in the heartlands you can find valentine cumberland forest big valley you know in the great plains roads like i said it's basically endless on where you can find them they're running wild over here in northern part of armadillo and also in this part here like in gap tooth ridge so you should be able to have no problem finding them rats sometimes can be tricky you can find them at bulger blade you can find them at lymphony which is just a little west of the heartlands you can also find them in an abandoned house over at that peninsula in Blue Water Marsh. Elysian Pool is a cave. There's also a cave at Roanoke Valley. And then you also have the docks over near Ansberg. 
So next we have skunks, which sometimes can be tough to find. I tend to go to these two locations here if I'm trying to find them in a jam. Uh, you can also find them in Big Valley. You can find them pretty commonly here in New Austin too, but sometimes that's out of the way and people don't feel like going out to that area to get them. So snakes are going to be next. You can find these obviously near water. Some of the best spots would be over in this area here near Blue Water Marsh. You can also find them in the swamp over here, just in the uh, southeastern part of Rhodes. And another good spot would be along this stream that leads up to the Cougar Spawn, Stillwater Creek, and also you can find them pretty easily in the desert here in New Austin. Moving on to squirrel next. You can find these in a lot of wooded areas. Some of the places that I find them a lot more often than not would be this area right here in this whole general region. You can also find them pretty easily in Cumberland Forest, Valentine, and also in the Big Valley area, as well as a lot of other locations. Uh, I'm not sure again how big of a role they're going to play in this trader update if it is in fact turned into some kind of a trapper role, but you can also find them here in the New Austin area. So last, we're going to go ahead and talk about a turtle. You can find these in uh, a few spots. The places I like to find them most would be the bayou and also the peninsula that is just a little northeast of Blue Water Marsh. So appreciate you guys watching. Look forward to part two and three where I talk about large pelts and also birds. Appreciate you guys watching and I'll see you next time.